hey, it's me. T from the Pattersons taking the train to Tibet. Hey, look, I would I wasn't going to do a posting right now. I may mean, have a posting that I did. But anyway, I'm trying to do one a day, but sometimes I have to do two a day because stuff happens, you know, because I'm just mouthing off. So you don't have to really, really listen to stuff like that. If you don't like mouthing off, then go someplace else. No, I shouldn't say that. I shouldn't. Get, no, 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 no. Stay stay for a little while. This is going to be short. I think it's the morning time. You know, so I got to do a thing. And it's a Monday, which means that it's my fasting day, which means it's water all day. Now, usually I do the fast, you know, from time, you know, from whatever time I wake up. Well, use the fast from the night before all the way to about nine o'clock at night when I usually break it with a salad. That's what I've been doing. So let's see what happens today. <laughs> and then, well, it's, it's not a 24 hours a day fast. But you know what I've been doing, too? Eating less on Sundays. I don't know why. And like building up to the fast or something like that. I don't know. All right. You know what today is? It's the 27th of... April. Now, that means absolutely nothing to most of the people on the planet because most of the people on the planet are not South African. <laughs> now, even though I'm, uh, you know, I can't get to South Africa right now because I'm sequestered, you know, my wife's not freaking out. I'm not freaking out. We haven't, you know, we do what we need to do. Uh, but South Africa right now, I called up, you know, I called up, but you know, I, I, I did the whole thing. You know, what's up is really nice because you, you know, you can just do press the thing down and just do a voice message. That's actually good too. You know what I mean? I usually just do the um, the the the, you know the the, the telephonic the the voice telephonic. I don't really like the the face to face the looking thing like that. Uh, not over this. It's some weird thing. I don't like when me, when mechanisms get in the way. I can't explain this. You know what I mean? In other words, if I'm gonna do a face to face, it's gonna be face to face. It's not gonna be face through a machine through another machine. To get to another face and then, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 no, it doesn't work like that. Not for me. Anyway, back to the point. So, um, so South Africa is, is Freedom Day, you know? So I called up to Thomas, going, hey, hey, happy Freedom Day to you and your crew, blah, blah, blah. And he reached me back, happy Freedom Day back. He said, well, well, well you're not South African. Well, that's what it is. Maybe Freedom Day should be all over the world. But here's the thing about Freedom Day for me, right? Now remember, it's, 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 it really was. It was like a Freedom Day was started in 1994, so last last century. Okay, oh, little joke there. 1994, and it was uh, done because uh, it, it celebrated the first electoral thing for South Africans. In other words, they could vote in a non whoever whoever in a whatever they want to call it. You know, it's a free. It's the first day they can vote for independent South Africa uh, out of the apartheid system. Okay, let's put it that way. It's a long way to put it, but that's the way I put it. Okay, and um, but when I think of Freedom Day, I always think of Mangalisa Robert Sabukwe. Now, most people say Robert Mangalisa Sabukwe, but I have uh, I have read him a, a while ago. You know what I mean? Uh, he's like one of my real. I mean, if you think of Robert Sabukwe, think of Robert Sabukwe. Think of like Malcolm X. In other words, it's like how how can we say this? Like like, you know, we have Martin Luther King and Mark, Malcolm X, right? Okay, so here you would have, um, you would have, uh, who's, who's the guy, Madiba? Um, you would have Nelson Mandela, Nelson Mandela's like, like, like um, um, what do you call it, Martin Luther King? And for me, Robert Sabukwe is like Malcolm X. And strangely enough, Robert Sabukwe and Malcolm X, they studied the same, I forget if whether it was C.R.L. James or somebody from the Caribbean, they had both studied the same thing. So when I started reading uh, Megalisa Robert Sabukwe, what could not confuse me, what was interesting is that I said, wait a second, this sounds like Malcolm X. Then I realized they both were, they both were influenced by the same uh, cat from the Caribbean. I guess he was by in England, and I, I gotta find this guy's name. I, I lost it. I don't. Uh, I figured out sometime. Anyway, so Mangalisa Robert Sabukwe. That's this guy right here, by the way. See, that's a thing from. That's that's one of his famous poses. See, he got gotta remember Africa there. But this is Mangalisa Robert Sabukwe. He was a staunch. Uh, I shouldn't say it like that, but he was a staunch Christian and stuff like that. But uh, anyway, he's a hero. He's a, he's a hero, and he's an African hero, you know? He's right up there for me. It's like, you know, it's like uh, uh, Amaka Cabral, you know, uh, the Krumba, you know, uh, uh, for that matter, uh, 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 the Jerry guy, whatever. 
uh, who else? Uh, well, of course, Mangalisa Rappas All these people are like, that's why, you know, Thomas Sankara, you know, these are my kind of African dudes, you know what I mean, that, that I'm into, you know. Dudes that do that. So I don't know. What females? I do have some females. Okay. So anyway, so happy Freedom Day to to one and all in South Africa, especially if you, especially if you're just a focal point. But for everybody, happy Freedom Day for those people who are into liberation. That's a little, you know, a little suggestion from me, T. And I'm talking to you. This is important from an undisclosed location. Okay, so keep your chin up. You know, be strong. Freedom.